Jay Palumbo with an RX muscle news update. Sad news in our bodybuilding world again. I feel like I say this way too much lately. Uh, Jeff Everson, a bodybuilding pioneer, former husband to six time Miss Olympia. Corey Everson, a former editor in chief of Muscle and Fitness magazine, owner of a Planet Fitness, and I know he did a lot of research. Uh, when he was at the University of Washington into the Krebs cycle. This guy was a, was a real smart, smart guy. One of the guys who really helped shape our industry and really created the persona of Corey Everson, uh, who became you know, uh, you know, an icon for, in women's bodybuilding. Uh, he, Jeff, uh, I got news this morning. I think it came directly from his, his ex, Corey, that he had passed away at age 65. And uh, the... the Rumors, at least I'm hearing, are heart-related. No one has a, an official cause of death yet. Jeff, obviously, as far as I knew, was a very healthy guy. You know, he championed the bodybuilding lifestyle his whole life. I, one of the things that really I remember Jeff as, you know, is back when he, right before he turned 40, he had gained a lot of weight. I guess he had been really focusing on running Muscle and Fitness and, and Flex Magazine. He was uh, working a lot of hours. And he had gotten really heavy, and he had, I think he had torn his pec or something like that. And he just was really out of shape. And he, and he got back in the best shape of his life. And he won Masters Nationals, got his pro card. And uh, they chronicled this whole transformation uh, via the product metrics. This was when metrics first came out back in the early 90s. And obviously, he credited that uh, a lot of his knowledge and his diet advice from Dr. Scott Connolly of the metrics. And I remember that's when I was really getting into bodybuilding at the time and following all that. And Jeff was instrumental in helping launch metrics. And making a lot of money for probably Bill Phillips and for Scott Conley, hopefully for himself as well. But Jeff was just one of these guys who just just knew a little bit about everything as far as bodybuilding and nutrition and supplementation and performance enhancing stuff. He wrote for many years for uh, Bill Phillips at Muscle Media 2000. I know they were friends for a while. And then, of course, Jeff eventually launched that magazine, Planet Muscle. Uh, and that was in existence until basically magazines just stop being functional anymore. Um, what happened to Jeff and if he had uh, health problems that he was suffering from, I don't know. No one really knew. I hadn't really talked to Jeff in a number of years. The last time I really spoke to him probably was about five or six years ago. And he kind of had disappeared from the bodybuilding scene as far as I knew. Uh, once again, I know I want to send all our prayers, condolences, and of course, uh, love out to Jeff's family, uh, to his ex, Corey, of course, who reported this news and to all the people who Jeff may have touched at one point in his life. Uh, very sad news. Uh, the industry lost a, a very great person in the way of Jeff Everson. Uh, once again, RX Muscle sends its prayers. I am Dave Palumbo with another RX Muscle news update.